And when the team brought that cup to Emily Arena tonight, they said they would not have made it this far without the fans' support. Our Ryan Smith continues our team coverage with the Lightning faithful who followed the team all over town today. Ryan? Well, it was certainly a historic night for this hockey town. That is for certain fans waiting patiently, some for hours in the rain, just to get that first glimpse of their championship team and the Stanley Cup trophy they delivered tonight here to Amelie Arena. Lord Stanley's Cup welcomed home by a sea of signs and bolts blue. The unforgiving rain, no match for these diehard fans. This team deserves everything that they've got. They fought for it tooth and nail, and they came out on top out of 24 teams that entered into the gauntlet. When the team touched down in Tampa, hundreds waited outside, hoping to get a glimpse at the cup and the players who brought it home. Just seeing all of my, literally my favorite people in the world, just so happy and so like accomplished that they finally got to the top of the mountain and just, oh, that just made me so happy. <laughs> Unexpected and incredible. Mayor Jane Castor on the tarmac at the right place at the right time. Is it as heavy as they say it is? It's heavier. <laughs> it was very heavy. I work out a lot and uh, it was heavy. The welcome home tour continued by trolley. Fans cheering on lightning players as they left the airport en route to Amelie Arena. Once inside, it was a fan frenzy to snap a quick pick with the cup. Best moment ever. After more than two months in a Canadian bubble, the Bolts are home, delivering fans so much more than a trophy in 2020. They showed our grit, determination, and, you know, just unending strength to, to win that game. And that really shows what Tampa and Tampa Bay are all about. So Bolts fans, hopefully, hopefully it won't be too much longer before we see another Stanley Cup statue gracing outside Thunder Alley. We can certainly look forward to that. The celebrations, meantime, they continue tomorrow night with a boat parade along the Riverwalk through downtown Tampa, followed by a fan rally at Raymond James Stadium. We have all the important details on how you can participate in those events online at abcactionnews.com. Live in downtown Tampa, Ryan Smith, ABC Action News.